Hello and welcome to Dan Cave Reviews. Uh, today we are going to review Blizzard Entertainment Hydra Zero from StarCraft 1. Oof. I found this guy by accident in a pawn shop. They didn't know what he was, they saw it with some kids toy I got for four bucks. And it wasn't in the box or anything, but totally worth it. Everything in it is perfect condition, no broken pieces, nothing. So I'll take him out here for you. It has a very flexible head, it has a nice little ball joint on the head, it's very loose. I'm always worried he's going to fall off, but no, he's pretty solid. The mouth moves up and down easily, some articulation with ball joints again on the uh, shoulders. And uh, a little bit on the claws here. It's maybe more of a kid friendly toy I found. Um, the tail has his little hole bubbles, so it actually can be flexed, but not that much. It does not have a lot of articulation with the tail. That's about as much as I can do with it. A little swerve. But, has a little smile on the back. He's, he's a very good character. He, uh, everything about him just looks nice. He looks just like Hydralisk. I don't know why they didn't do more of these toys. They were such a limited run, and fans today would love a reprint of these. I know they would. So, with it further ado, I'll give you a little, I'll pull out this little cheese. Please play here, and we'll do a rotation. That was another StarCraft figure falling over that I'm viewing, I just reviewed. Alright. Stay still, little man. Yeah. Well, that is StarCraft's Hydralix Zerg. Uh, yeah, Blizzard Entertainment only. So if you like this video, please like, share, subscribe. Nice going, Dan Gave.